everyone. I'm Travis Guillory from Two Works For You, and here's your latest digital update. State officials say that over 500 Oklahomans who tested positive for COVID-19 have recovered from the virus. New reports show that out of the more than 1,300 confirmed cases in the Sooner State, only 754 are currently active. The State Health Department also tells us that 11,000 negative COVID-19 tests were processed in private labs dating back to early February. That brings our state total for coronavirus tests to about 13,000. So far, 51 Oklahomans have died and 13 of those victims were nursing home patients. And this afternoon, the Tulsa City Council is going to hold a meeting via video conference. They're going to be discussing an ordinance to amend the fiscal year for 2019-2020 to uh, move some funds around and that meeting is going to be at 530 this evening. Also, Broken Arrow City Council also is going to hold a special meeting this afternoon. That one's going to focus on possibly amending the proclamation ordering all citizens to shelter in place as well as discussing additional measures to enforce essential business guidelines. And over the next week, state lawmakers are going to be discussing tapping into the state's rainy day funds in order to uh, help businesses and to help residents. Because of coronavirus, state officials say that the state's going to lose about $416 million in revenue. While the rainy day fund does have money available to make up for the loss, Governor Stitt says that there's still some technical issues that do need to be worked out. And lastly, the House and the Senate approved what's called the Catastrophic Health Emergency Act yesterday. And that gives Governor Stitt the authority to temporarily suspend laws that might be interfering with the state's ability to respond to the coronavirus outbreak. It also gives the governor the ability to redirect state employees, funds, as well as resources from one agency to another. And that's your latest digital update from Two Works For You. I'm Travis Guillory.